Why do some individuals experience significant withdrawal symptoms whilst others do not? What differentiates those who can taper off SSRIs without issue versus those who struggle with severe or protracted withdrawal? To understand this, we must move beyond labels because thinking about protracted withdrawal or severe withdrawal or discontinuation or withdrawal or relapse doesn't really help us understand the broader construct because what we know is that individuals could have both physiological symptoms and emotional symptoms. They could have a combination of both or separate emotional and physiological symptoms. It's also important to recognize that these agents might have been prescribed in a physical condition like pain, but the cessation can result in both a physical rebound and an emotional rebound.